<clears throat> Jimmy, cut that nonsense off right now. But now, nah. fine. So why are you in here again? Don't you know, Junior? It's Black History Month. I'm supposed to care about that because because it celebrates our culture. Don't we do that every day? Let me tell you a story about what it was like before all these video games were invented. My great great grandfather, your great 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 grandfather told me the story about what it was like during 18 62, a year before the Civil War ended. What does he look like? Come over and look. Okay. Jeez, that's what great-grandfather looks like? I mean, great-great-great-grandfather looks like. Yep. Sit down, Junior. Like your mother said, I'm going to tell you the story about your great-great-great-grandfather. Your great-great-grandfather was very, very strong. He was a slave at the William McKinley, not William McKinley, the McKinley Mining Company. Y'all are on break now. Yeah. Except for you two. Y'all keep working. M -m -m Master, why can't we have a break? Cause I say so, now get to work! Wait a second. What's that in your pocket, boy? It's nothing. Wait a second. It's a letter from the Yankees. I must tell the boss. Boss, look, it's a letter from the Yankees. What's it say? Read it out loud. It says, Dear Mr. Thomas, we will be sending troops right down to the McKinley Mining Company. Thank you for letting us know that there was a Confederate army there. Thanks, slave. Did what? He mailed a letter to the Yankee, sir. Bring me that slave. Now. Groggy. How dare you betray me. Get on the ground. Now. Yes, sir. Whip him. You, sir? You the overseer, ain't you? All right. For disobeying the great Edward McKinley, you shall be beaten. Ah. Uh. Again, sir. I say it again. Get him up. Oh, yeah. My name ain't Kennedy. It's McKinley. You heard me? Get him out of here. Someday you will be the one being lashed at. Why'd you do that? Do you want brother? Whip it out of sleeve. It's my property. I get to do whatever I want with him. It's not like he's a man or something. I could have sworn the Constitution says all men are created equal. I don't give a crap what that Constitution said. He's my property, and I'm going to do what I want with him. What's gotten into you? Have you been studying them Yankee papers? No, I'm just upset that you beat him. But what was I supposed to do? Just let him go free? After what he did to set me up, nobody knew that the Confederacy was over here. I can't do this anymore. I'm leaving. You can't do that to your brother! What will mother think? What will father think? Most important of all, what will I think? I'm done, Edward. Charlie, you get yourself back over here right now. Am I one of your slaves? Come on. What in blazes with that? Why it's the Yankees? I ain't know them Yankees were coming today. You better protect my property. Right now. Trust me, you get the job done. Look, Yankees, y'all violating the law. Get off my private property immediately. <laughs> 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 It's a fight you want. It's a fight you gon' get. Get ready for the fight of your lives! Fire damn cannon. 
Oh, be fire! Oh my gosh! Oh my leg! My leg is bleeding! You suppress it fire! Oh! Oh! We got one shot at this man! Ready? Aim! Fire! What? Oh! Oh no, we lost a commander. I'm in charge of that. Keep firing. With all due respect, sir, we barely have an, an army. Ah! Let's get out of here. No, we have to keep fighting. We're gonna help you. We're abolitionists. Let's get out of here. Charge! You two and all the other slaves here are free. Now, do you see why slavery is important? I mean, not only slavery, but black history in general. Now, do you know why it's important? Yes, I do. I have a song that will go great with the victory. What type of song?